The borderland has had multiple scares involving swimming. With both the holiday weekend and warmer weather ahead, first responders are now telling the public to stay vigilant. According to the Texas Department of Family and Protective Services, 20 kids have drowned in Texas this year. One of those on the list is right here in the borderland. About a week ago, El Paso fire officials confirmed the death of a three year old child after he drowned at Camp Cohen Water Park in Northeast El Paso. ABC 7 spoke with El Paso Fire Department spokesman Enrique Duenas, who says these kinds of calls are more common in the summertime. Duenas adds timing is everything in these situations, and it is important to call 911 as soon as you see something is wrong. He says it's important to keep your children close to you in the water, making sure they're wearing flotation devices and to be vigilant at all times. A couple of seconds can be fatal, so just leave that call, call back later, never leave the child unattended. If you have to do something else, get the child out of the water and that way you can be safe because uh, emergencies happen like this when nobody's expecting them and this is exactly how this happens. People are just going out there for something real quick. They are just picking up their phone. They're just checking a message and this is when it happens. Coming up on ABC 7 at 10, Brianna Perez speaks with an aquatics manager about the importance of lifeguard training.